Rita Edwards watched her mother, mother battle mental illness her entire life. The artist knew she wanted to help others find a better path to battle mental health. She just never thought that she'd be doing it through stories on skin. 10 News reporter Bobby Lewis is on the road in Dunedin where a tattoo artist is helping others overcome their struggles by adding a little bit of ink. Yeah, I love tattoos. There are plenty of reasons to get a tattoo. Not bad at all. Haley Ernst is adding angels. They're really cute. <laughs> yeah. A cute They're and colorful cute. story on her right arm. Yeah. Opposite the once painful story on her left. They got there through self-harm. I started um, getting depressed. Haley's depression led to cutting. Um, it just kind of cutting led to scarring. And scarring led her to Lita Edwards. I, it's my passion. I couldn't imagine doing anything different. Lita has done all of Haley's tattoos. <laughs> She specializes in covering scars, both physical and emotional. I found a way to be different. I found a way to take my work and my love and my craft and use it to make a difference in someone's life every day. People no. <laughs> like Haley. I have something people are going to look at and be like, wow, that's pretty, not like what's going on with your arm. Lita's job is challenging, but it's also quite rewarding. She's been tattooing now for 11 years, taking those scarring life experiences, something difficult, and transforming them into something dazzling. She named her shop Metamorphosis Inc. because a metamorphosis is exactly what's happening for the people who are sitting in her chair, transforming the lives of people through tattoos. When I got into tattooing, it was I realized that it was a way that I could control the pain and end up with something beautiful versus something ugly left behind. What do people say now when they look at your arm? They're like, where did you get that done? That's so pretty. <laughs> it's definitely encouraging for me. Just knowing that that big bulk of my life is now covered with something beautiful other than like scars, it's definitely nice to know. <laughs> and they are beautiful. Yeah, they are. Her work is beautiful. Lita says that she's lost count of how many cover up tattoos that she's done. She gets a lot of tattoo referrals from doctors at Moffitt Cancer Center. Man, how awesome is that? A large part of her business, by the way, comes from women who want to tattoo over their mastectomy scars. We have a gallery of her work online. If you want to check it out, it's on our free 10 News app.